Hey, what's up guys? The free download for that LUT is in the description, so if you like it and use LUTs then go check it out. I'm also going to show you how you can get that same sort of colour grade just using the Final Cut Pro colour correction. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is add an adjustment layer. These adjustment layers are amazing because you can just add effects and colour corrections and all sorts of stuff and because it's over the top of your footage it will apply it to all of the clips underneath. So you want to select your adjustment layer and then press command 6 and that's going to bring up the colour board right here. We're going to add the pink colour to the sky. So we're just going to use this global one right here and we're just going to move that up to the pink and then we're going to go back. In your colour correction bit here you've got this little icon. If you want to click that and then just go to add colour mask and now we're going to select the bit that we want to go pink. If you click and hold and then slide your mouse down then you can actually select a larger part than if you were just to kind of click. If you just click it only selects a really small part of the colour. So yeah just click and hold until you kind of get the bit you want to turn pink. So now it looks way too harsh so what we're going to do is go to softness right here and just move that up. And now we're going to go back into the colour correction so we can kind of tweak this and make it look how you want it. Just going to go right there. And now what you want to do is go back into your colour correction and click up here and go to add colour correction. And now what we want to do is we're going to turn the C into that nice like teal colour. So grab your global and just move it into the teal colour right there and then go back and hit that icon again, add a colour mask and then you just want to select the C just like that and then softness turn that all the way up and now the C and like the kind of the dark blues have gone to that nice teal colour uh, let's add one more and let's turn this yellow into a bit more pink put that up there add a colour mask and so yeah there you go there's the colour correction right there you can see it if I dis disable this adjustment layer if you play through this you'll see that because we've used an adjustment layer the cut that colour correction has just automatically gone on to the next shot Say if your like exposure's way off on certain clips, what I would do is just change the exposure on the clips individually. So if you just select the shot, command six, and then you can go to exposure and I would change the exposure that way. So it's probably best to do the colour on the adjustment layer and then the exposure on the actual individual shots itself. So yeah, you don't actually need LUTs if you want to make a nice colour grade. You can just use the inbuilt Final Cut Pro colour correction and you can get some pretty nice results from it. Hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one.